Hey everybody, what's up? This is Kendra. I am back just to do a quick little video because I really wanted to show you all um, my choices and some things. If you have not seen everybody posting and sharing, I have shared tons and tons of pictures of the new papers and stickers that are available in Hobby Lobby or coming to your Hobby Lobby soon. Um, but I posted, follow me on Instagram, 504 Pretty Things on Instagram so you can see all the pictures um, in like real time of all the things as they're coming out. So let's just jump right into them and show you all some things that I hold. Everything that I purchased in this haul is 50% off. I barely, I rarely buy anything from Hobby Lobby unless it's 50% off. So let's just go. So I'm gonna start with the single sheets. Um, picked up this pretty, pretty stencil sheet. And if you see along here, you can cut this into borders if you want to. Or you can just overlay this over a 12 by 12 size. So um, it is, it was a dollar. So that was a really cool find. Let's turn these over. Um, this is one of the new 12 by 12 sheets with the cameras on it. Floral cameras at that. Really, really pretty. And this one was 35 cents. They increased that price. Of the twelve of all the papers, actually the single papers. Um, here is a single sheet that I picked up. I actually found the pick the twelve by twelve paper pad of this after I purchased this. Thirty five cents as well. I was really really hunting for this one, so I picked up a couple of these, and these are gonna be um, permanent for a while in Hobby Lobby. <clears throat> it's just a new line that's coming out. So these are the bowls, black and white bowls, and they were 30 cents. Love these. You can color these if you want to. You can um, leave them black and white. I picked up one of the cactus sheets, cactus cacti. Really excited about this. Figuring I can use this in my trip to Vegas on Tuesday. I will be headed to Vegas on Tuesday, y'all. Um, really love this one. The tickets with the florals and the plaids. Really, really cute sheet to me. And that one was 30 cents. And um, so that's it for the single sheets. And the next, I'm going to show uh, the single vellums. So this is a new vellum sheet. There are tons. I mean, I, I didn't even, I couldn't even purchase half. I, it was so much more I wanted to get, but I do know that the line is going to be there. Um, I do know that the sale is going to come back for 50% off. So I was like, okay, I don't need to grab everything. Right now, I need to save this money for this trip. Because I heard Vegas is expensive, baby. And y'all know we just coming back from a trip. So, yeah, our, our pocket's going to be hurting. So this is a heart vellum with a gold. And these were all 50 cents. Cannot beat that price. I'm surprised the vellums are not $2. And then... You pay a dollar with a sale, but I'll take this 50 cents. Here's a gold foil floral sheet. And these are all 50 cents. Next here is a vellum. This is very, very pretty. Something different. It's like hues of pinks and purples and grays. Really cute. 50 cents. And then my, oh, not my last one. <laughs> And I picked up this one. I think this one coordinates with the uh, Petals and Bloom collection. Pretty vellum. And the last vellum is this one. This is something different. I don't know what it's called, but it's like hues of purples and blues and oranges. Something different, very pretty. So next, <clears throat> in addition to papers and stickers, I mean, Hobby Lobby is just revamping every single thing. So there are a whole bunch of... Um, new paper packs like this. I mean, you've all seen these at Hobby Lobby with the, the sticker sheet and then the coordinating papers. Um, so, yes, let me show you my choices. Uh, again, if you want to see more, I have probably 90, 85% of them posted on my Instagram page. Um, just taking pictures and videos in the store. I was like completely overwhelmed in the store because it was so much. I was like, oh my God, okay. So, yes. The first one I'm gonna show you all, um, and this one was eleven dollars. So of, of course I paid what is that five fifty half off. So the flora 
collection and I, I was tempted to order this so many times on scrapbook.com but I didn't want to pay the price of it when it first came out and then it was always out of stock like you couldn't find you could find one the sheet, sticker sheet but you couldn't find the paper pad or you couldn't find so I said okay well for 450 I mean 550 this will give me a my little fix next one i found this one by photo play and this one was only five dollars and it's called rhapsody and this is very pretty look at the dream catchers um very pretty beautiful like watercolor florals look at that floral guitar the butterflies this is beautiful to me look at that look at that camera so as always, you get one sticker sheet. I was trying to find where it says, but here's the sticker sheet. Let me show you the stickers. Look how beautiful. I love the color coordination of this one. Look at that hat. So cute. The umbrella. I use this in my um, cruise journal because it rained one of the days. So that'll be perfect in there. So, yeah. So I was trying to see the, it says 13 pieces. So it's probably the same, just one sticker sheet and 12 papers, like all the rest of them. Yep, 12 sheets, double-sided, and then one sticker sheet. So that's really cute. Um, really excited about this one, Cosmopol Cosmopolitan. And um, this one was 50% off as well. And this is just the rose gold and the grays. Very pretty. This will coordinate with that mom beat. There's a, a new um, Me and My Big Ideas paper pad that have these colors. It's different from the the, the first uh, rose gold one that everybody was hauling last year. Um, there's a new one. I think it's called XOXO. And they have, um, no, no. XOXO is a paper studio one that coordinates with this one also it have these exact same colors and have swans and which coordinates with the washi tape from michael's that have these colors and the swans but me and my big ideas have a paper pad also with these exact same colors that will coordinate with this perfectly didn't pick it up i probably i will probably get it all eventually but um like i said i got trips coming up so well one more trip coming up so yeah, so this one is like this. A lot of alphas. These are pretty stickers. You could definitely use those for layering. I mean, I wouldn't just put that down on my paper by itself. You you know, you could layer some words on top of it. And things of that nature. So this one, you get 10 papers, one vellum, a vellum sticker sheet, a card size sticker sheet, and a paper sticker sheet. That's pretty cool. And look at these are some of the papers with the swans. Okay, so this one is meant to coordinate with the Paper Studio pad I just mentioned. And it is on my page, on my Instagram. Very pretty. So if this is your style, that pad's for you. And then here is, I picked up the I Love My Dog pad. 50% off. Here are some of the stickers. I want to work on some stuff for my fur babies. That's a cute little sticker. And so you get some alphas, you get an embellishment sheet. And here are some of the papers. You know, you get two of each. So yes, so pick that up. Um, next, I guess before I jump into the, I guess I'll show you all the couple of the stickers that I picked up. Like I said, I couldn't get them all. Um, I just, I picked this up. I wasn't sure if this was new. Um, or if this was there before, but it was 50% off. There are some new ones like this. There are the, there were some with feathers on it. There was some with like some watercolors on it. So I know when these first came out, it didn't have a whole lot of um. And excuse, I'm washing y'all. So if you hear my washing machine going, excuse that. But you know it's the weekend, so I got mommy mommy wife duties. Um. So well, not mommy, cause King D is in Dallas. And by the way, they um, lost their first bracket game this morning. So they are out of the second place round and we'll be heading back to Texas. So we didn't place this time, but you know, it's all good. You can't win them all, right? Um, so yes, yeah, so back to <laughs> back to crafts. Um, 
yes but there are some new ones like this not sure if this one is new if you haven't seen this one you know check it out <clears throat> but i thought that was cute a couple um stickers that i picked up there are tons and tons and tons of new stickers again go check out your hobby lobby if you have one if you don't i'm so sorry you probably have to wait for the um the website they're not these are not on the website yet last i checked but um yeah so here's the unicorns i am not a huge i think i've mentioned this before i'm not a huge unicorn or llama fan um but i am noticing some of the unicorns are getting cuter and cuter to me i don't know if you know marketing is just throwing it in my face so much i'm still not feeling the llamas i don't feel the llamas like at all unicorns i can't probably deal with but them llamas baby have a seat sorry for all you all that love them llamas but yeah i don't i don't get the llamas at all um here's another sticker sheet i picked this one up because i love the pastel colors of this so we all have a lot of our pastel paper pads that can coordinate with that nicely here are some three-dimensional food stickers really cute can use those in my scrapbook for the cruise because you know on the cruise baby that's all you do is eat 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 <laughs> um i shared these on instagram but these are some cactus stickers and you you know you fold over this little flap and it makes that um there are also some cupcakes that do the exact same thing um these are some new stickers and hobby lobby some three-dimensional airplanes flying to vegas on tuesday my king d is having his very first flight oh, oh shit and guess what i gotta come back because i didn't cut the dog on tabs i think i cut them on all of them except this one i'm gonna have to show this one at the end i have to show that at the end shoot i thought i called myself doing them all but i forgot about that little one so next this is a new paper pad by prima that's in um hobby lobby so it was on sale for ten dollars and this is all pink and i don't know funny like rosy kind of color they are all double-sided papers but they are very pretty some it's different very different so if you're looking we all have a lot of look at that we all have a lot of paper in our collection so i try to find i'm trying to look for things that i don't have something that is similar two and this is one of those pads look like you get about four or five of each design i love that page so this and these papers are thick y'all know prima has very good quality items i love how one side has the busy design and then the other side uh the back side have the planer so if you want to make uh, travel notebooks with this you can still journal on one side and still have the other side as your pretty print Look at that. I love this one. Look at those cut aparts. Beautiful. Love the colors. And yeah, so, and quite a few cut apart sheets. So I probably could share some of those. Look at that with the marbling. And that's it. That's it for that one. So really love that one. Um, I shared this on Instagram, but for those that are not following me over there, I will do a quick flip through of this one. Y'all know this pad is all me. I hunted for this pad until I found it. <laughs> I went in an area I normally don't even go into. But love the florals. $10 for the pad. Beautiful. And I swear when I posted this video, if at least three or four people didn't ask me, what you gonna do with that? What you gonna do with that? What you gonna do with that? I'd be like, can I live? Like, can I just show y'all? You wanna know what I buy, how much it is, what I'ma do with it, what I'ma do with it after I make it. Like, come on people, y'all give me a break, okay? Give me a break. I know y'all want my life, but you can't have my life. You cannot have my life. I don't be asking y'all what y'all gonna do Every time you post something. But what you gonna do with that? Question mark, question mark, question mark. I be like, really? Really? You really wanna know that bad? And I know it, it don't come from a bad place. So I'm not over the top with those kind of comments. But when like three and four and five people come on the same post, I be like, dang. Can I 
Don't just show the paper bag. Yeah, you bought that and it's nice, but what you gonna do with it? I don't know. What you gonna do with everything that's in your craft room? That's 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 how I really be feeling. Just like truth be told. I don't know. I don't shop with a purpose, y'all. I'm gonna tell y'all that right now. I don't I buy pretty things. It's in my bio. That's what I say. I buy pretty things. So if it's pretty. I love having options. So when I do get down, when I do sit down and get ready to craft and make something, I don't have to say. I will never have to say, oh, I wish I had this to go with this because this will be so perfectly with this because I remember what I have. And when I sit down, everything I need, I have it. So I don't shop with a purpose in or I can, I mean, very rare, very seldom. Let me say that. I do sometimes look for like you know fourth of july you know things like that we all do that but generally speaking i don't shop with a purpose i just shop if you shop with a purchase purpose you shop on a budget you know whatever to each his own and this is the one everybody was looking for see and look i don't have a damn tags off of this one let me be back I i'll be right back guys Okay, y'all, sorry about that. I'm back. I am. I have taken off the tab so I can do a full flip through. But this is the one that is going to be the most popular. I am um, sure of it. I wasn't going to get this, but the only thing, the only reason why I got this, well, I looked at some of the flip throughs, specifically Scrap Diva 29. She's the first person that I really watched the flip through of. Um, I did see a pink. Parisian, I think that's her name on Instagram. I don't know if I watched her flip through, but I did see that she purchased it. And um, that's how I knew that it was out there from her, actually. But I saw Scrap Diva 29 do the flip through. And it was a couple pages like that one. Um, and that one, maybe I will make those some brown girls. But I was like, okay, well, maybe I could work with that. And then it was only, you know... The little seven fifty. It wasn't ten dollars. So I said, okay, I could work with her. Some of these are cute. And these are the paper. These aren't the these are not cardstock. And I think I mentioned before, if it's $14.99, nine times out of ten, it's the paper paper. If it's a twenty dollars, then it's normally the heavier cardstock. So just FYI if you haven't paid attention to that. The flamingos. The eyelashes, very similar to some of the papers that are in the Hot Buy Pads from Michaels. Love this sheet. This is one of the sheets that sold me also. So, yes. All this, like that kind of stuff. Maybe as a background. Maybe that would be cool as a background print. Um, yeah, so. I probably will just use this, this pad for layering. I mean, it's not too much more you can do with the the thinner papers layer them on your heavier car stock i like that page i think i've seen that somewhere but the only thing i'm disappointed and why i wasn't going to get this one initially is because it's the same pattern and the print as the washi tapes that page sold me but it's not the same colors like why if you're gonna make a pad to coordinate with the washi tape why you make it a totally different color why make it light blue pink and black and white and the washi tapes is like oranges and cream and I, I don't understand it so that's why i wasn't gonna get it because that's that's before to me that's crazy but anyway um and then here's the six by six just do a quick flip through and i did pick up some fourth of july items from the clearance my store was fully stocked <laughs> at 80 percent off so i won't share those i shared them on my instagram but that's really really cute but I picked up quite a few 4th of July items. I don't think y'all are interested in that. Because people are not even interested in buying it in the stores. Because it was fully stocked, okay? So, yes. Yeah, so, I got this pad for $3. So, that is it, guys. This will be my last haul. I have been picking up things from Tuesday morning. Sharing a lot. Again, I wasn't even going to do a video before next week. Um, but I just want to share the Hobby Lobby in case you all... Today is the last day for the sale for this week, but the 50% off sale will be back. We all know that. Um, so thank you all for watching this video. I will see you all in the next one. You want to see more what I've been buying, what I've been finding. 
head over to my Instagram, 504 Pretty Things. Thank y'all so much, guys. Have a good weekend. Peace. Hey, guys. I forgot one thing <laughs> from this doggone haul. Um, and this was, and this is something I really want to show you all. These are the strips. You get 60 sheets and they are ad adhesive, um, strips with different patterns. I think I saw Mommy Loves Gigi haul the paper pad, a six, I think a smaller paper pad and they were adhesive sheets, but I want to show you all. These are $3. I want to show you all the different prints. Very cute. I can't do this with one hand cause it's, it's not really turning right. Um, but yes, really, really cute. You can use these in your planners. You can use them with punches. Perfect with punches. They already have the adhesive on the back. So I want to share this. And I think there are other patterns. I'm sure there are going to be other patterns, new patterns coming. But it's really cool how they have the adhesive already. Look at that one. Really cute. Look at that one. It's a pink stripe. And that's it. So I just want to show you all this one.